I got a question. We talk, we talk about God and religion and spirituality. So, what's your take on like how, like church people be views on marijuana and LSD and all that? I feel like I feel like a person should not be judged by what he do, like on his personal time. You know what I'm saying? And. I feel like, you know, at the end of the day, we all sinners, man. Just because somebody don't go to church every Sunday, just because somebody goes to church all the time, doesn't mean that they're better than that one person who goes to church every Sunday or that, one, or that person who doesn't go to church at all, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, church is a personal thing. It's a relationship with God. It's about what you do at home and how you carry that with you. Like, where you, everywhere you go and how you treat people, you know? Like, I was when I was going to church, I kept the G with my pastor. I told him straight out, I said, yo, I smoke weed. I ain't had nothing to lie. We, we don't want to trips to, to other churches and all that. Like, you know what I'm saying? But why, why lie to the pastor? You know what I mean? That would be wrong of me. I'd rather just keep G with him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's the right thing to do. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, like, I feel like if God really wanted me to stop something, he'll, he'll, I don't know when it's the time. You know what I mean? But right now, I'm young. I got a lot of problems. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm a good dude. You feel me? Like, I ain't perfect. You know what I'm saying? I'm, but. Yeah, and that's what it's essentially about. Like, you feel me? They ain't have all this shit. The wrong only question to people is, how you know what God wants? They ain't have all this shit when they was writing the Bible. <laughs> you feel me? At the end of the day, at the end of the day, look, between me and me and y'all, man, I even I even got baptized my lead up. You feel me? Like that I the reason I did it cause I cause like It was a spiritual it cleansing. Was, it, it, yeah, and not only that, but like like when I'm off psychedelics, all I wanna do is pray to God and and talk to him more, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do that. I well, do that you know, in ancient too, times, they even said, like, they used to use, like, psychedelics and all, all nothing ain't new. Yeah, Nothing's exactly. new. You know what I mean? They used to use all this shit to pray to God. That even, like, in Rome, the, the they used to go to the temple, and that's how they talked to the gods through a monk who used to that, stay over the opium um, and, shit. And, and that's where people get drugs fucked up. People think that taking drugs is to just be high and act stupid. Like, nah, man. It's your mind you stay with everything. You're gonna do something and know why you're doing it and know how is it helping you. It's supposed to be medicine, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I only mess with natural stuff, you know what I'm saying? I mean, they say, they say, they say acid is like man-made or whatever, but like, if you look up your facts, you can't get hooked to it. And they, it is extracted off other, like, psychedelics. It's not like a bunch of, like, crazy mm -hmm. shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, so at the end of the day, it's like, if you don't know about it, don't judge people, you feel me? That's my thing. If you don't, if you never did it, don't, don't judge people. Like, me, I have the opportunity to speak to stoners about God and Christ and, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And other people who mess with psychedelics. An, uh, another person might be like, oh, nah, I can't, I can't fuck with him because he fuck with that, so I ain't even going to chill around him. So you ain't even going to preach the word to him because of that? You mm -hmm. feel me? You going to bash him and make him feel uncomfortable? Nah, man, smoke a with that nigga. Talk to the nigga, man. Be his friend. Because that's what God wants us to have, relationships. And, you know, we're all brothers and sisters at the end of the day, man. Nobody perfect. Straight like that. God's hit me. 420.